Welcome to Slayer Fest 98. I'm Ian Carlos Crawford, and uh, this is my first time doing a solo watch along reaction video. Um, let's see how it goes. I'm going to watch the first two episodes of X Men 97. If you know me, you know X Men. X Men and Buffy are my two favorite things. You can see I have my like X Men shelf here, my Buffy shelf there. Uh, I've been really excited about this. The Discourse has been driving me absolutely up a wall because, I don't know, just for many, many reasons, but I am letting myself be excited about this. Uh, all the reviews have been great. It's mostly people that haven't watched it have been like, oh, this looks stupid. Um, so I'm just going to get started and watch this. Ah, start the theme song. Oh my God. Oh my God. I'm so excited. I like that Bishop and Morph are added. Ooh, I love that Emma and Lady Deathstrike are added into the villains running. I literally have the chills. I like... Ugh, this was every Saturday morning as a kid. To me, my X-Men is the title of this episode. Very good title. Oh, these are the Friends of Humanity. A.K.A. everyone commenting negative shit on my posts about this show. Q Lady Gaga's born this way. Looks like a storm's rolling in. I can't wait for her to freeze all these people. Ugh. Ugh, hearing her voice. I feel like this is just me 30 minutes of me smiling big. He just said X-Men are like roaches. You see one more coming and to be honest, yeah, there's going to be a lot more, <laughs> which I love. I also love Sunspot kind of being the Jubilee in this. Oh my god. The box of rollerblades! Uh. Gambit is so hot! Rogue wearing her pink dress from the first episode is making me so happy! But Jesus Christ, Gambit! <laughs> he was like my first childhood crush. I'm glad to see that however many years later, he can still do it for me. <laughs> Cyclops does have a disdain for fun. Pregnant Jean Grey. Jesus Christ, Gambit. <laughs> Getting the vapors from this cartoon. Jubilee! Okay. So it's most clearly in the danger room, but also this is a reference to, like, Pride of the X-Men and the X-Men arcade game, right? Shoot gold balls from your body in reference to gold balls. Fuck, I love it. Also, I wish I could rock Jubilee's basketball outfit because it is cute. Oh, Wolverine and Cyclops fighting, just like old times. And Wolverine giving puppy dog eyes to Jean. I love that they're at a club and that Rogue is wearing her dress from Night of the Sentinels and Wolverine is wearing the same outfit that were always his civilian clothes. I had the five inch Toy Biz action figure of that Wolverine. I always wanted action figures of all of them in all their regular clothes. Oh, I love this. I think Rogue and Gambit are still one of the only straight couples I care about. <laughs> Morph turning into pregnant Jean is so good. <laughs> Alright, everyone who said this animation looks bad was wrong, because this looks good. Ugh, I love this. Gyrick is basically just quoting, like, the fucking... Every conservative group talking about queer people. Tolerance is extinction. Fuck! Get his ass, Gene. I'm a Wolverine. Dismember his ass. Wolverine calling Cyclops dad. Not not into it. This angle. So much is happening. More of turning into Archangel. Fuck! Another Catch the X-Men day. Ah. Also, this is like every time I played with my action figures, they would be in the Blackbird and it would blow up. Every time. Oh, I can't wait to see them chop up a ton of Sentinels and Rogue to punch through them. Where's Thor? Ah. Fuck. Give him the forecast. They just called her to make a live a mutant. Yes. Oh my god, Storm, give me a speech. 
Okay, weird note. Val Cooper, I know she's voiced by the original Jean Grey voice. Kind of sounds like Angelica Houston. Oh my god. Gambit being a himbo. Fucking take it off his shirt. If they're gone, who's going to lead the team? Uh, Storm. Shit, Magneto would hurt it at all. Oh my god, even the closing credits are like from the original series. With the action figure screen looking thing. <sighs> Alright, we're going to watch the next episode. Alright, I'm not skipping the intro, even though I just saw it. Was Magneto in the first episode's credits? I don't know. I can't remember now. Ooh, Dark Phoenix. Callisto and Leech sounded like the original voices, but I'm not sure if they were. I do love Magneto having his, like, old costume, and also, like, I'm looking respectfully at those arms. Magneto sending them all to Genosha, which has me worried they'll do the plot of Frank Quietly's run, where they all die. Magneto saying he's not there for the drama, absolutely is there for the drama. The way he said teta tets sounded like tetas, and I'm like, hmm, he does got some. Jean Grey holding her green dress, talking about the Dark Phoenix saga. The discourse this scene spurned made me want to become the Joker. But I think this is a really nice scene. Someone said this on Twitter that, like, it's soap opera-y, but that's what the X-Men are. That's why X-Men and Buffy are my favorite things, because it's always these quieter moments of just them, like, being friends and talking, and then the action. You sound like a mother. Me every time Sam Marshall Geller speaks. Magneto is snatched, Jesus Christ. But also him talking about Charles always in his mind. Gay. Complimentary, though. So Rogue and Magneto had a thing, all right. Just like Rogue and Joseph, I think. Aren't the X-Men going to stop Magneto? All right, Magneto, you ain't getting a fair trial, but also you are a former terrorist. God, Magneto is jacked. Also, this costume is like drag. I love it. Fuck, that is a good line. They play by the rules and they play by the rules and they still come for you. <laughs> Her saying he's here and thinking she means a villain. She's going into birth, fuck. God, I love the Executioner song when I was younger. Executioner is every fucking comment I got on my first X-Men post on Instagram. Morph just turned into Deathstrike, Colossus, and then Psylocke. Ah, love it. I do wonder, are they, like, it's supposed to be that he can, like, use people's powers? Do not think, be silent, and heed my commands. Storm! This is good. Oh, Magneto better kick his ass for shooting Storm. <gasps> he took away her powers. Magneto's never been more right. Ooh, what's he gonna do with these people? Fuck, this is so good. Nathan! Ah, uh, this cable! Okay, we're gonna give Storm back her powers, right? Permanent! But I want Rogue and Gambit together, not Rogue and Magneto, but the tracks. God, this drama is so good. Beast crying. <gasps> so good well I loved that um the A pluses all around oh that was so good um I'm not sure if I'm gonna do more for every episode but I'm definitely gonna do one for the finale uh yeah make sure you subscribe like us uh you can find us on social media everywhere at SlayerFest X98 um you can find some X-Men pins on our Etsy shop and uh yeah, I'll see you next time. Bye.